Hi, I'm Mark Hargrove, and I just wanted to talk to you a little bit about our uh, Black History Month uh, festivities this year. We kicked it off today with our Freedom Breakfast uh, here on the Racine campus. The breakfast was very good, and it was very good turnout. There was a lot of planning that came into this, and it was very a very good turnout. Our guest speaker was uh, Zena Hayworth, our uh, Vice President and Provost of Gateway Technical College. Gateway's commitment, and that's commitment to diversity and inclusion commitment to African Americans here at our college. And she really talked about the importance of having diversity in school and also how important it is to talk about black history. The events following the rest of the month, we have a couple of movies we're going to be showing district-wide. One of them is uh, Marshall, the story of Thurgood Marshall. The other one is a light comedy called Coming to America starring Eddie Murphy. We also have an exciting event called Black History Month Family Feud that will be uh, have that activity on all three campuses and it's going to be a fun and fun packed event uh, with teams of faculty, staff and students competing each other for prizes. Family Feud is really the one I'm trying to like pop out in because you know like it is a game to have people come together you know and honestly test your knowledge and then the cookout. The cookout is going to be real fun. Final event and the culmination of the month will be what we call our Black History Month cookout. Uh, that includes uh, barbecue and ribs, and we'll also have a live DJ from the radio station that'll keep the activity fun. To, and also during the course of the, course of the month, we're going to be running a Black History Month essay contest that's open to all students of Gateway. Uh, we have a first prize of $200 through a fourth prize of $50. Uh, for a two-page essay, and the theme of that essay is uh, people in African or African-American history that have made tremendous contributions throughout history, but went unrecognized. So that should be something that can give the students a better knowledge and, and understanding of people who've made contributions throughout history that happen to be African-American.